Time now for the buzz. Dean Richards is here with us. Yeah, we've got lots of things to do this weekend, including all kinds of music for you to enjoy. In music, Saturday at Joe's Live in Rosemont, Salsa King Tito Nieves performs. It's the Thuggish Ruggers Ball. It's the Thuggish Ruggers Ball. At the Afterlife Music Hall in Lombard, it's 90s rappers Bone, Thugs, and Harmony. Great performances roll on at the Arcata Theater in St. Charles all weekend. Saturday with classic rockers The Fix. Come on, come on. Baby, don't you want to go? Y'all can help me say that. And on Sunday, blues legend Buddy Guy plays the Arcata. I rock the stars to be humble. Yeah. I told my baby girl she gonna have more in her head than just brought up and bundled. Yeah. At the House of Blues on Sunday, it's Houston rapper Toby Wigway's The Minimalist Tour. I said airports, airports. I can't deal with the people that work at Hudson Booksellers. For laughs, Chelsea Handler the plays the Chicago the Theater Friday. But you tell me this in front of all my friends. Why he have tattoo? Michael Yo performs all weekend at the Improv in Schomburg. When I'm choosing dinner, it's not up for a group debate, okay? <laughs> What I choose to put in my mouth is not subjected to the democratic process anymore. And at Zany Chicago, our very own Pat Tomasulo takes the mic Friday and Saturday nights. On stage, Lyric Opera's production of Mozart's The Magic Flute is running through November 27th. At the movies, there's Kenneth Branagh's written and directed Belfast, a semi-autobiographical story of his growing up in Northern Ireland, a Dean's List B+. Plus. Look at you. Hello, Casey. So cute. And for the kids, a new version of Clifford the Big Red Dog, a Dean's List C+. Plus. And uh, you can get my full movie reviews, this week's home video picks, and more information on things to do for the weekend just by scanning the QR code that's on your screen. That'll take you directly to a link to get more information. And don't forget, before you go out this weekend, check with the venues for their current COVID protocols. Also this weekend, the Chicago Film Critics Association is presenting its eighth annual film festival at the Music Box Theater. It opens today with the Chicago premiere of Maggie Gyllenhaal's directorial debut, The Lost Daughter, that stars Olivia Coleman and Dakota Johnson. This is a weekend long festival that includes some of the year's most anticipated films, a little early, some classics and also some documentaries. You can get more information at chicagofilmcritics.org. Also for tonight, the Chicago Botanic Gardens Lightscapes kicks off. The annual holiday spectacle of thousands of holiday lights illuminating a walkway trail in the garden with five new art installations as part of the exhibit. Lightscape kicks off tonight and will run through January the 3rd. See chicagobotanic.org for tickets and more information.